What's up, guys? It's Tim and Alfredo. What's up, Tim? Okay, so today we are playing GTA V, the first mission in first person. Next gen. Ooh. That next gen GTA in first person. That's exciting. So, you know, everyone's played this mission. Yeah, everyone's familiar with this. Mm -hmm. So we just want to go ahead and show it off uh, in new that new... F yeah. <laughs> in a whole different perspective. There's a lot. There's a lot that goes on here. Um, so you got a little bit of shooting, a little bit of driving. So we just wanted to go ahead and show you guys. Now, I'm on the PS4. My character transferred over from the 360. Mm -hmm. uh, on the PlayStation, I'm going to press... The, uh, the touchpad. Yep, exactly. There you go, Tim. I'm going to click it. I'm going to click it again. It's going through different views. And now I'm Bam. in first person. Now, this is crazy. something I do want to note too as well, um, when you go into first person, most of you are probably going to want to go into your settings, right? You want to go into your controls. You want to go all the way down here, first person control type. Uh, it's set to something else. Mm. Um, I think it's set to like standard third person or something. Go ahead and switch it over to standard FPS. What other options do we got here though? Uh, alternatives, the weird South stuff, Paul. like Southpaw, okay. like, well, I don't even, that's the stuff that you used to use or something, yeah. <laughs> like Southpaw Legacy when you played Halo 1, like, yep. I don't even know, but we're gonna go to traditional, if I could refine it, I lost it, Tim, where'd it go? Um, Tim, there you go, there Wait, you go, standard, no, that's no, 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 that's, two, that's two, I want one, there, standard we, go. there we go, there we go, okay, uh, alright, we found our way back home, good, all right, now I'm going to back out. Now, you're a big first-person shooter guy. I like to shoot things. So I'm excited to see what you feel about this. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm assuming traditional FPS controls. I just took a glance at them. I'm assuming that means uh, L2 to ADS, aim down sights, and then R2 to shoot. And uh, we'll see how the controls look like. Um, this is interesting. It's just, uh, It looks detailed. I mean, like, look at his glove and look how, like, the light shines off of it. And yeah, this is looking good. This looks actually really good. All right, y'all get back up, back the hell up. <laughs> get into the room. This is a hold up. Tim, GTA allows me to do mm -hmm. things I can't do in real life. Like like scream at people. Exactly. And use weird voices. Mm -hmm. You got to, you know yeah. what I mean? You got to mask your voice, otherwise people will know you. Yeah. They'd be like, oh my God, that's, oh, that's that one dude from the IGN videos. <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool. Now I'm going to bring up my cell phone. Mm -hmm. Ooh, first person... These gloves, fancy. Yeah. He's got some next style. Gen gloves. I'm going to detonate it. Oh, I hear it on my controller. Yeah, the PS4 has a little mic now. Yeah. <laughs> That's interesting. Man, this brings back memories. Yeah. It's it's really interesting seeing it in first person, though. Like the, So one of the big things is a lot of new animations in this next-gen version. Yep. Um, and you can do all the... Pretty much anything you could do in GTA V, you can now do in first person. Mm -hmm. So whether you're driving or shooting or walking or punching or rolling or flying, whatever, it's mm -hmm. all in first person. And at any moment, you can just hit the button and go back to third. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You speak truth, Tim. I do. I do. I saw your face. I remember you. Get a thousand things. Mm -hmm. uh, That's not what you say. You know what I mean? You don't hold him up and say, I saw your face. I remember you. <laughs> All right, I'm going to switch over, and then, no hesitation, pull the trigger. Bam. He's gone. He's, He's gone, Tim. Done. That's it. His life is he gone. Just, it's he over. He's got GTA'd. He That's what happens in GTA'd. this world. Now, if I click in uh, R3, wait, nope, I can't do it yet. No, nah, but it would be your iron sights. It would be my iron sights, but I can't yet. I'm going to take cover, though. First person cover. Oh, look at that, though. Because you're wearing the ski mask yeah. with the goggle thingy. You see the outline. That's that's fancy. Boom. All right. Wow. Sweet. See, what's really cool about this is the level of detail in the animation. Because Whoa. it was a, I'm turning around. a third, third person. That's interesting. To look at your back like that? Okay. <laughs> Wait, is that like looking over your shoulder? That's just like turning around. Like, uh, yeah, yeah, what's, yeah. Behind, what, what's that? What's behind me? That's cool. You know what I mean? Someone trying to sneak up on you like, surprise! Oh, that's sweet auto-aim. And then that's my tactical roll. Wait, and let's see that roll again. I just held... Whoa. I just held left, and then I hit square. And then now I'm jumping on things. Oh, this is sick. I'm going to reload. A double, a double press square. <laughs> Duck, dodge, dip, duck, and dodge. This is sick. 
Well, so here's the question, Alfredo. Like, right. does this feel right? It feels good. It does. It doesn't, it doesn't feel. It doesn't feel like weird. I mean, it's just weird playing GTA in first person, but it looks beautiful and it controls well. The fact that they entered in like FPS, like traditional like FPS controls, mm -hmm. smart, smart people over there, at Rockstar. They're yeah. smart. They get it. But so like, come, I mean, you're a big first person shooter guy. Yeah. So it, if you would know if it felt off, does this feel off, or do just, you, are nah, you enjoying it? It doesn't feel off. Good. Things like the uh, the tactical role seems a little weird. Mm -hmm. You don't really get that in like other first person shooter games. Mm -hmm. It's not like a normal thing. Like, uh, can I tactical roll again? I guess not right now. But yeah, um, I think the sense is just the prologue. Yeah, the prologue, like, just limiting me to stuff. This is sick, though. Oh my goodness, that first person GTA's. Oh uh, yeah. So when I ADS and then when I click R3, that's what switches back and forth between iron sights and non iron mm. sights. That's how it's done, people. Yeah. All right, Let's now get in the car. Now we're gonna get some car driving action. First person vehicular. Warfare? I don't, no, know. No, I don't know if it's warfare yet, unless you want it to be. It's it's Grand Theft. It's our destiny of Grand well, this is the Theft auto Warfare. That we're Grand Theft in. Uh, collection. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Just add everything together, Tim. Yep. <clears throat> now I do remember, like, if there was a part, uh, like near the bridge on the ice, there was like an alien. Yeah, like, underneath. Remember it. that? Yeah. yeah. The memory is the GTA is bringing back to me right now. See, when they first announced, all right, next-gen GTA, um, it's got first person. I was like, for me, I've already dumped in like 200 hours into this game. So I was like, eh. But now, since it's so easy to transfer over my character, mm -hmm. um, and now that I, it's actually in my hands and I'm playing, this is fun. Mm -hmm. like, it, it feels it feels good, and it just, I don't know. It's, yeah, well, a lot of people were hyped up about this first-person mm -hmm. mode. Mm -hmm. And there's a lot of questions, so I'm, I'm happy to hear that. It, it feels right. It looks good. Feels I mean, it looks good. amazing. That's Plays the thing. well. It looks amazing. I'm not looking at the road. Oh! I just oh, also want to test that out. That scared me. It scared me bad, Alfredo. <laughs> not gonna lie. <laughs> Don't worry, Tim. You're safe when I'm in the car. So the thing is, too, with the, it's really customizable because you can at any point switch between first and third person. But in addition to that, whoop! My God, it's That's crazy. Furious. Uh you can turn off specific animations if they they bother you like if you don't want it to be first person when you do the tactical role you can make that so it'll switch to third person for that and things like that yeah there's a lot of things that they've uh there's just so many different little tweaks and features and stuff like that that they've added to next gen gta so it's really nice to know mm -hmm. that they've it's not just a straight up like hey, here you go it's here next it's, gen it's hd it's pretty yeah go for it it's nice to know that it's, uh it's got some some changes to it. Yeah, they got 150 new songs. Yes, that's insane. I heard the Backstreet Boys is in there. There, are, there is some Backstreet Boys. I'm I want excited. it that way. I'm, I'm hyped. I want to rob a bank <laughs> and drive away from the cops while jamming out to that. There you go. You know what I mean? Something that only Grand Theft Auto can allow. Exactly. That's this right? Mm -hmm. Oh man, it's so fun. It's it's so interesting knowing like how everything eventually pans out. Like I'm not gonna spoil anything, but it's just. Mm -hmm. I finish the story and it's just like there's some tough decisions, some tough choices. <laughs> Man, this is crazy. It's it's it's, it's good. That auto aim, <laughs> uh, that aim assist, not <laughs> aim assist, uh -huh. but no, it looks good and it plays well. But yeah, so you know, Tim and I just wanted to show off the first mission because pretty much everyone that has played GTA has. Yeah, if you play you, GTA, you play GTA, you play through this mission. Yeah, because you have to play through it to get to the online exactly. mode. So everybody. So everybody it's a little this. taste of everything: the driving, mm -hmm. the shooting, the tactical rolling. Yeah, I'm pretty excited it. about this, Alfredo. Yeah, it's it's uh it's definitely got me hooked again. Mm -hmm. So that was fun. Well, let us know what you guys think in the comments below, and stay tuned for way more next-gen GTA 5 content. Yes, here on IGN.